variety shows that are out there, and they're all pretty good, but the Foundry, well, it's a little greater. These are the jokes, people, and they are not getting better. Hey, Flagstaff Foundry, happy 50th show! Woo -woo. What is up, the Foundry? It's your Scandinavian correspondent, Magnus. So good to see you guys again. Congratulations on the anniversary. Hey, Flagstaff Foundry, it's Dennis, former member of Tiny Punches. I uh, just wanted to wish you guys a happy 50th birthday. I can't Bye, everyone. Happy 50th show, Foundry. <laughs> Tonight I'm producing the show. And I just pitch in whatever's needed or nothing. And I volunteer and perform sometimes, uh, most of, like every episode. I just took an improv class with Garrison Garcia, and next thing I knew I was mopping the floors after the founder. This is now I like him better because he's got a third thing. <laughs> eh, eh, eh. Oh, you know, just making sure this lo show is lit. <laughs> I don't, I write it, I don't even know what it's called. Um, I'm almost ready for the cue music, nearly. And let me make sure. Not a professional show. Yeah, not a professional, not a professional show. Professional show. Not show. Uh, to think back to a simpler time, perhaps when, uh, when families would gather around behind their home, behind, why would they gather around? That'd be weird and culty. Uh, I'm gonna flash my lights. Uh, welcome to the Foundry, ladies and gentlemen. Let's, let's hear it if you've been here before. Yeah, pretty good. Uh, you guys ready for a variety show this evening? You can go to tinyurl.com. Tinyurl.com. Wait, what's the first part though? Oh, I, I hate heckling. You hate it? Hate it. Honestly? Remember that time you were all like, I'm Garrison. Whoa, hey, you <laughs> came to the show. Thanks. Look That's all me. the time. Yeah. Looking good. Get out of my face, paparazzi. Like, keep it, keep it, keep it, keep it, keep it going for at least tonight, but first and foremost, I need to get warmed up, so, alright, down the back, back up, alright. <laughs> Go ahead. Okay, Go ahead. one of my favorite memories is uh, when Joni had the first, I think the first Joni dance, and I got to see your genitals on full display. Oh, that was also one of my favorite nights. So I got to show my taint to a complete audience of almost strangers. Yeah, cool um, times. And my favorite moment uh, at the Flagstaff Foundry was when local comedian Dennis um, and Sarah had a person off. And it was this ridiculous, just nonstop, five, like three or four minute birthing dance around a Madonna song and it was just hysterical <laughs> was Clara's last show when she lip synced time after time while she did an aerial lyric performance metal to the max biker dude and he pulls out a harmonica 
out of his leather jacket <laughs> and stands up and accompanies Ryan Bider so beautifully. There was not a dry eye in the audience. It was beautiful. It brought us together. And that is the magic of the foundry. I like all the animals and I like the free stuff that they give you when you come in, like the t-shirts and all the like free and all the Uh, to where we used to gather around the warm glow of a radio and listen to the serials every week, we've got one of our own here. It's called the Flagstone Four, and we're going to check in with our locally inspired superheroes here. Uh, for your enjoyment, please allow me to introduce to present Boundary Radio. These questions are too easy. Ask about dog laws. Ask about stop, sit, and frisk. We need to see both candidates' pedigrees. Yeah, wag the dog! What the heck's a mail lunch? It's my favorite pre-packaged ship meal service. They send the ingredients along in waves, and so after a few months, you've collected all the necessary ingredients to make one full meal. <laughs> What's up, Flagstaff Foundry? It's me, Marley J. I heard it's your 50th show. That's crazy. Ugh. This is an emergency message for any members of the Flagstone Four. It's me, Marley. Well, not the Marley from your time. A Marley from a different time. Garrison looks great for 50. For time. I smoked a spliff so strong it sent me into the future. And then I'm relaying this message to the past. We're going to call it Blaze of Future Past. All right. I hear that you guys have made it uh, to the 50th. Flag, staff, boundary, whatever the fuck that is. I just wanted you guys to know, during your episode tonight, just make sure you don't... Oh no. They're coming. Oh god, not again. Please, just make sure... I also have this funny feeling there's other Marlies? I don't know. Alright. <coughs> Okay. Do we have any more brown sugar cinnamon? I don't know. Funding's been cut on Fridays at home. All right, so uh, you'll have to work your Fridays out on your own. I think it's like nine. It's like nine. Are these one of those millennials? You are so rude. Yeah, from Victoria. A nice pants. They make them in men's. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really pissed off because it's stuck with a mouse. Oh. <laughs> I wish I could pull off a blouse. Yes! Bye, sweeties. And I love you guys.